Donald Trump did 7-Eleven. Hey, what's going on, everybody? It's Decker Gaming here, and welcome to a top five video. And today, we're gonna be talking about the top five best Call of Duty Easter eggs in history. Now, I know I'm gonna leave a lot of them out, but these are personally my top five favorite. But I know I said top five, but actually, this is a list that is in a non particular order. So, without further ado, let's get straight into it. So, number five, we have Modern Warfare 3. The Teddy Bear holding two Desert Eagles, golden Desert Eagles from the original Call of Duty 4. And honestly, this was so cool and kind of creepy. I mean, look at that face. It's cool. And these guns you can't get in the game. You can, These were from Modern Warfare 1, aka COD 4. So basically, that was it. There's really not that much to say. On to the next one. So number four is coming from Modern Warfare. Oh, I'm stupid. World at War. My bad. So basically, this was the birth of the ray gun. And this was before zombies even came. And this was the very first appearance of the ray gun. I forgot in what mission. So you have to jump in this hole and then a few times and then you'll see these statues pop up. They'll say some weird stuff. And in each mouth, you'll find a beautiful ray gun. And you can pick it up from all of them. They're all the same. It doesn't matter which one you pick up. But this was the very first appearance of the ray gun. And it was the coolest easter egg in World at War at the time. Because no one know what it was. So, on to the next one. So, on number three, we got Black Ops 1. And basically, you have to throw these grenades all the way down there until they, like, blow up these green things. I forgot what they're called, like, nitrogen. Then go over and press X, I believe, until you see that cassette tape or whatever. Go down. And then you will skip all the way up here to the refrigerator where they push the fridge. And then you'll go up in here and put down that cassette tape. And this was also, I think, the first appearance of this. AKA the Thunder Gun. Look at this beast gun. I'm pretty sure this was the first appearance of this gun to zombies. And this was actually pretty cool. So, on to the next one. So, finally, the best for last, Call of Duty Ghosts. Well, this was the part of Call of Duty Ghosts that sucked. AKA Extinction. So, basically, what you have to do is... You have to shoot um, these things right here. All four, I believe they are. So you have to shoot all four of them, and this is the zap easter egg. So, once you shoot, like, all of them, you should get, like, a little message that will pop up on your screen that says zap right there. Now, what this does is turns any zombie you kill. It's, it's so cool. You, you guys have to watch it. it. It explains it for itself. So, this is on Nightfall Extinction. I had the season pass, so it it came with the game because I got like the Harden edition or something. So I actually got to try this one out, but I had to borrow footage for this. I actually borrowed footage for all of these clips, so yeah, those clips weren't mine. So just to warn you. All right. So once you do all that, once Zap pops up, any Zombie, wait, 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 not zombie, alien you kill will turn into a snowman 
Holy crap, look at that. They just blow up into snow and then a snowman head. I thought that was awesome. And that's the one of the only things I liked from Extinction, this Easter egg. And I thought it was so cool. And it was. It was. So, basically, that is it. So, this one is from Black Ops 2. So, it is on Nuketown. You all know this one where you shoot off all of the mannequins' heads. And you have to do it in, I think it's 90 seconds about. Or something around that. So, you have to shoot all of their heads down. Once you do, you go to the Welcome to Newtown sign. And you will see this. You could play an old 8-bit game from, like, Act the original Activision. And this was actually pretty cool. This was one of the coolest Easter eggs in Black Ops 2. And it was actually pretty fun. And I recommend you do it with a second friend because it's hard to do it. So that is it for this top 5. I hope you guys have enjoyed this list. If you have enjoyed, please drop a like comment and of course subscribe if you think i missed any of them put them in the comment section i am probably thinking of making a part two to this because i know there is a lot more out there and trust me there are so much out so basically that's it thank you all for watching and of course subscribe and one more thing, this Sunday will be my first shout out Sunday. I'll probably make a video tomorrow about this on how to enter. Because I want to start this. I want to give like smaller YouTube channels like a chance. Like help boost up their subscribers and help them out a little bit. So yeah, that is all I have to say. See you guys in the next video. Bye. Take care, my deckers. Peace out.